Uh, hello everybody and welcome back to some Project Gozo 3. How you guys doing today? I hope you are doing well. So, last episode, we pretty much finished up Lordcraft. Uh, the only thing we hadn't done is finished the last few quests. Uh, for this stuff. I've made the stuff. We'll worry about that stuff at another point. Uh, today, we're going to get into Applied Energistics. That's why that's up. Um, it's time to get some of this stuff under control around here. Specifically, all these dang chests. And I also want to get stuff going so I can get our mob farm rebuilt, redone, storage. Not have to worry about anything. So that is our goal today. So, first off and such forth, we needed to get Surtis Quartz, which we've already got Surtis Quartz. That part is done. Next thing we're going to need is these presses. This should not be too hard to do. Each one of them has a recipe. Uh, Surtis Quartz Essence, Diamond, Pure Surtis Quartz, Gold, silicon all things are easily done the hardest part of it is going to be getting some service court that's quartz essence it's not really a hard part I just got to go get it all this stuff is being auto crafted so we can pop over her look we've already got all we need there we go back home And it's night time. Alright, so first thing we're going to need is we need pure service quartz. Uh, there is... Wait. That is... Yeah, that's what we need. Um, if we look at this, there's recipes. We can do this in an enrichment chamber, which is quite lovely. Because we... My cow's hiding. Um... This one. So this will get us our pure Sardis Quartz. Matter of fact, I probably should, just for the sake of it, go ahead and grab, I don't know, two stacks. Because we're going to need a few of these. And let that go. Alright, so. While we're at it, before we do that, let's grab a piece of gold, a diamond, and silicon is the one thing I have not done. I got everything else together but silicon. Now, I've got silicon seeds, not necessarily real hard for us to throw together. So, calculation press, engineering press, logic press and silicon press so those are actually all pretty easy to make now you can make doubles of these inside of an inscriber block of iron and whichever press you want to to double one should be sufficient enough for us while we go through this so next up we need to make the inscriber itself Scriber, uh, we need to make Fluix Crystals first. We can do that. We need Charged. And we've got a few. Not very many. Um, we have one. Really? That's all we've got? Uh, let's see here. I need to get that out of there. There's four more. So how can we make these? Energetic infuser. 
that doesn't do us any good that doesn't do us any good so energetic infuser is our best way of making these but for the most part the only thing we really need these for are going to be because we can use either charged or regular service courts for these um, is going to be for making our uh, flux crystals and the nice thing is I don't have any water here Humana. let's go here we need to turn our magnet off I've been in here killing mobs All right, so our two Sirtis, two Redstone, two Nether Quartz. That gives us our four uh, Fluix that we need. I cut the music off. And now we should be able to make seeds with this. And we need some premium seeds. And it just so happens that that is the last bit that I done. There we go. There is our fluid seeds. Oh, why there's emeralds there? Um, I spent did spend some time off camera. We need to sleep. Um, if you'll notice when we wake up here. Uh, we have our second set of hearts. I went ahead and crafted those. Uh, basically, they just take golden apple and ten of the red hearts, so we're good to go there. We now have, it's not showing now, uh, but we now have three sets of hearts. So, beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I need to get rid of this. Rid of that, that. Let's see what's in here. Oh no, not those. Oh, I almost goofed. I don't need that. I almost threw our seeds away. That would have sucked. Alright, so we've got all the fluix we need. Give me my magnet back. There we go. So now we need to make some pistons. We're going to need iron. We're going to need redstone. We're going to need wood. We're going to need cobblestone. Yeah, lots of pistons. Been making lots of pits, needing lots of pistons. Alright, so. To make these, we need sticky pistons. I've got slime balls, I think, somewhere. This is why we need our AE system. There we go, sticky pistons. And we're going to make the advanced inscriber, so we're going to need one for each press. So that's one, two, three, four. Four more for the others. Well, it doesn't matter. Uh, for now, we'll just make six. That works. So there we go. Now, we are also going to need power. And I don't know if I've got another... 
I'm going to have to make another Tangler Porter. Not Tangler Porter, but... Yeah, that's what it is. One of these here. Should have... One, two, three, four... One of those, two of those, and we're going to need that. Mm -hmm. Alright, beautiful. Another one of those. So most of this stuff we're going to set up back here. I'm going to move this. This should. We want power. Auto eject on. And all sets. Alright, that's got power. Beautiful. So like I said, the first thing we want to do. Let's do that. We want to go ahead and work on getting the advanced inscriber. Because these are not very good. Um, put that in there. We need some more silicon. The problem with these is we can only do one piece at a time. And that's where the issue lies. Um, it's a slower process. So we want to go ahead and upgrade these. So in order to upgrade these, we are going to need two engineering processors. So let me get that done, and I will be back. All right, we're back. We've got enough to make one. Figure we go ahead and make one and make the rest of them with it because it makes life a lot easier. So there we go. Advanced and scrap now these several differences one these have got spots for five speed upgrades. This one has three This one also We're going to need some more Diamonds put these in here. We can now put stacks of stuff in here And these do not accept straight power from this That is good to know Can we? Where is? Just for the moment. No. 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 That don't work. What about, for now, placing it right here? That don't work. So we're going to have to make an energy acceptor, I guess. So that is quartz glass, which is crushed quartz in that. We may actually have some quartz glass somewhere. I made some. Um, no, doesn't look like it. All right, so we've got to make. I need this stuff right here. This is why I'm doing AE now. I want to get this stuff done. So we can, or get it done so we can start automating processes, get our machines upgraded, get through all this stuff a lot easier than what we are right now. Alright, so energy acceptor. I need one more. There's that. And we're missing iron. So 
So this we should be able to place right there. There we go. Now we've got power. And now we can make the rest of these. All right, we're back. There we go. We've got all five of these set up. I can start mass producing these things, which is beautiful because that's what we're fixing to do. So first thing, let's throw in silicon. We're going to need a lot more silicon than that. Calculation, logic, and inscriber. All right. For the moment, let's grab what silicon we got. Grab a stack of gold, stack of diamonds, and let's go get our calculation stuff. We are not a calculation, but our pure that we've got over here. Beautiful. Two stacks of those. All right, so silicon calculation logic diamonds. I'm going to let all these go. This one right here is going to be the one that's going to hold us back the most. I'm going to sit and make us each one of these processors. Let's take a look at them. Um, all it takes, we just done that. Uh, I'm going to make a bunch of these, and then I will be back. All right, we're back. We got a handful of each of these. Uh, should be enough for us to take care of what we at least are going to accomplish today. So there is a quest complete. Uh, this will give us our choice of processors. We're going to choose logic processors. And the only reason being is because that's going to be um, most of what we're going to be using in this. They're all easy to make now. Uh, we just wind up using more logic than we do any of the rest of them. Um, so one of the things we need to do right quick is we need to make some flux dust. And the only reason why we need to do that is for quest completion purposes here. Uh, we got that. We've got that. We've got the crystal dust, which we've made crushed quartz, crushed certus quartz, and crushed fluid or flux quartz. Uh, we just made quartz glass, and of course, we just made the energy acceptor. So. Next up is we probably need to make the ME control. Start with the brains of stuff. So to make the ME controller, we're going to need pure fluix. So that is something that we need to look at. We can make it. Oh, we can make it in the enrichment chamber with that. We're going to need at least four. So let's go ahead and throw. That in there. We'll let that go. We've got sand. The blood moon is arising. Basically, take sand, fluid dust, that'll give you seeds. You get two seeds per each one. And let's put these over here in this. See how long that takes. Doesn't look too bad. It's not actually bad. Either. We can get this a lot faster. Hey, our cow's back. There we go. Skystone. We have made... I've made Skystone seeds. Um, but in order to make Skystone, I don't even have... Where's my buckets? As usual, we are missing buckets. 
There we go. Anyway, so make sky stone, lava, sky stone dust gives you sky stone. That's all it takes. All right, take your sky stone, throw it in our smelter here. How are we doing on our power? Oh, this thing's still way keeping up. Way keeping up. That is lovely. Anyways, there's that. And there is our first controller. For now, we're going to throw it on there. This is all going to move once I get everything done here. Alright, so our next bit of business is going to be to make... Um, I don't want to make the drive yet. Uh, let's work on the crafting terminal. Crafting terminal is going to be our next bit of business. So we're going to need to make these annihilation cores and formation cores, which we're going to need some more dust. Wait, we still got dust going over here, don't we? We do. Let's go ahead and get some more going. We're going to need a couple of those. Let's make a few of those. We're going to need them. And a few of those. We're going to need them. And we have also got a lot of stuff in our inventory. Oh, this silicon is silicon that I got from my seeds. Um, it, when you craft them, it gives you the nuclear craft silicon. It's ore dictionary for be able to be used with anything. So our next thing we are going to need is a panel, which we're going to need three more quartz glass, some glowstone, and some redstone. So I've got to make some more quartz glass. All right, so... There is our terminals. There is a ME terminal. This basically will allow you to see into your system. Not like that. I always do that. We need to make some... I used everything I had. Alright, let's make some cables. So, to make these, first thing we're going to need is these quartz fiber. I just put the class up, trying to clean up some inventory space. So there is three of those, and there is plenty of those. And I don't think I got... Okay, I did. So now we can place this here, place our terminal on here, and we can look in here. Basically, it'll show us everything that we have. It just won't allow us to craft anything with it. That is what we are going to do now. So we need a piece of wood. We are going to need a crafting table, and we should have everything we need To do this. Boom. There we go. So now we've got that. We can look in here. We can see everything we will have stored. And we can also craft with that. So. The next bit of business I guess we need to do. Is to actually work on the drives. That is. 
should be a fairly straightforward thing for us to do. And so it is. We're only going to make one for now. Unless we have to do another one for the quest. Nope. So we can place this for now. We'll just place it right there. This will allow us to put our disk drives in here. And we'll be able to start storing stuff. So I guess our next bit of business is going to be to actually make start making some disks. Um, as is usual, I'm going, um, uh, I'll be going straight for the 64K drives. Um, just cause it makes life simpler. That's one of the problems that I have with playing. Is I have a real bad tendency of just straight going in. When I get, I refuse to get started with Applied until we get to this point. And we've got 116K, so I've got to make a lot more. And I believe I just used pure ones for that. I think we're out of redstone. Uh, let's put some, uh, yeah, glass that we don't need. I don't know if we need the glass or not. We don't need the cables. Inventory management is a flaw. Um, what was I going after? Redstone. So there's that. There's five more that should be enough for us to get 164K. It is. We've already got that. 64k drive boom we got one that is lovely now to actually make the drive itself we need not a blank pattern we need this right here so we're going to need some more quartz glad we should have everything we need for that there we go. Throw that in there. And now I can start storing stuff in there. Which is beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So let us... We're going to go ahead and claim what quest we've got to claim. And then that's probably going to be where we're going to stop at. Those we got to make all the cables. Wait, if the controller turns red, that means there's too many controllers, or there are at least two controllers that are not connected to each other. Okay, I did not know that. Now, this pack does have extra cells in it. Um, so we've got the, the massive, massive storage disks in here. And while we're at it, let us go ahead. There's a couple of other quests that I need to complete. while we're at it. We've got our Fluex Seed. We got our Night Metal one we never completed. I think that's it. Alright, yep. Yeah, so got a whole nother great big stack of racks. Just because we can. Oh, 
Oh, that's lovely. Anytime I can get a crux without having to... Matter of fact, that gives us another quest. Anytime I can get a crux without having to craft it is beautiful. So, but with that, that's it. That gets you started up. At least get your basic storage done. I'm going to figure out how I want to set this all up over here. And then come back next episode and we'll get into some more of it. So with that, I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. I thank you for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.